Hey guys, today we'll be replacing a cracked screen on the Asus X540M laptop. So as you can see, we have significant damage to this LCD screen here. So we've ordered a brand new screen, which we will be using to replace this one. Okay, first step is always power off your device. And we're gonna actually uh, go ahead and do a hard shutdown here. Once your device is powered off, I just want to unplug your laptop. So now that we have the laptop powered off and unplugged, we're going to remove two screws in the lower part of the LCD screen. So you see one here, and there's also one on the right side of the laptop. They're covered by little uh, plastic covers. Please use a plastic, a plastic tool to take that cover off. If you use uh, metal or anything like that, you're gonna end up damaging that plastic cover. You don't wanna do that. So we'll go ahead and remove those two screws. I'm gonna do the same on the other side here. All right, after you remove those two screws, you can actually go around the cover of this laptop and just gently pry up the plastic frame. Now, oh, as a reminder, this is just for this model. Not every laptop is the same. But on this model, you can uh, easily just go around the frame and remove this cover. You wanna do this gently so you don't damage the frame. All right, so we have the uh, LCD frame removed. So next thing we wanna do is go ahead and remove the two screws at the top here. So just gonna point these out. You have one right here and one more screw over there that we're going to remove as well. All right, so once you remove those top screws, there are gonna be two more screws at the bottom here that you wanna remove. So one over here that we're going to go ahead and uncover and the other one should be covered. Uh, up over here that we'll go ahead and remove. And once you get those covers off, just go ahead and unscrew those uh, screws. All right, once you remove those four screws, we'll be able to place the screen now. So we're just gonna take it down right here. You'll have the uh, connector right here. So there's uh, tape connecting this to the back of the board. Go ahead and un uh, remove this tape here. All right, so we're removing that tape be very careful uh, not to damage this connector here. All right, so we got it disconnected. I'm gonna remove the uh, damage board to the side, and now we're gonna pull out our new board. New screen here. And we'll just connect this right back to the new replacement device. Make sure that uh, tape is connected. And after that, we can simply place the screen back. All right, so after you put the screen back in place, go ahead and screw back in those four screws here. We have one up there to the right up there, on the bottom. Put those screws in. Like the video, have any questions for me, uh, just shoot me a message or leave a comment and I'll be happy to answer those questions for you. Thanks guys.